Hi, I'm Chris from Podcast Engineering School, and in this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about the plugin called Max Volume from Waves. It's a really cool plugin for podcast production because it it controls dynamics. It it brings down the loud parts so they're not that loud, and it brings up the lower parts so they're not that low. And in podcast production, that is really important because if the end listener has to ride the volume knob, that's the worst thing in podcasting that you can do in terms of podcast production. So you want to control the dynamics so that the listener can have a good experience. So if we go here, uh, I'm in Reaper, but doesn't matter what DAW you're using. This is the plugin. This is max volume from Waves, and it's really cool. And you can see on the top right, there's a little waveform of me talking. And you see how in the beginning of the waveform, like this part here, I'm pretty loud, and that's fine. But then you see this part here. Look, see, see how low my voice gets. The volume gets really low. And so if we just listen to it without any of the max volume applied yet, just listen to the raw audio, you'll hear it's nice and loud here, but then as soon as it gets here, it, it's much lower, much lower. And that's the kind, these are the kind of spaces that uh, if you were driving in a car listen, listening to a podcast, you, you probably wouldn't understand these words, these several words here. It would just be lost in the the road noise, right? So let's let's listen to the raw audio. So I remember we were talking about, or you guys mentioned binaural a couple times, and and uh, there's also this uh, ambio. So you see, I kind of start. I'm talking fine, but then I start to go under my breath, right? And that's fine. That's natural for people speaking. That's natural for podcast guests. So uh, the max volume is really cool because you could see there's a low level section here on the left, and on the towards the right, there's a high level section. This low level section, what it does is, this is the section that brings up the lower um, the lower audio. So when, you, when I mumbled stuff under my breath, this is gonna bring it up. So you just bring the threshold up. Uh, right now I have it around 34, whatever. Um, and then the gain, you can actually bring the gain up if you need to, if you need more or less gain. And then here, this meter right here, you'll see the amount of the amount that it's pushing it up. You see, it starts from zero on the bottom, then it goes three, six, 12, 24, 36, 48. You'll see when, when, I, when I start to mumble, it'll push this up a little bit, which is cool. Uh, and so we'll go over to the high level and you have a threshold. The high level actually works very similar to a regular compressor. You just bring bring the threshold down from the top and until you until you get the amount of compression you want. Where did I have it? 12.8, okay. And then the gain also, I just brought the gain down here to match the dry signal for this, you know, for this video, so. But anyway, and then you have the output level here, obviously. In the middle, you have, a, it says a gate right here. This, this is a gate right here, and I kind of set it, I usually put my gates somewhere around minus 50 for podcasting. Uh, and I'm using it just to kind of use it to show that. Um, the leveler here, I actually didn't really figure I played with this. I didn't really, I don't really know what it does. So I'm just kind of leaving it there. Um, and, and then there's this soft and then loud button here. You see, I'm switching it from soft to loud. Apparently that adjusts the release time somehow. And so if you have it on soft, it'll it, like, if you have it on loud, the, the audio will sound like it's more in your face. And if you have it on soft, it'll just be sort of normal, not not so much in your face. So, and I, I thought for podcast production, probably soft is better. Um, it, but it, it's up to you, and it depends on the bo the voice, and it depends on how far away they were from their microphone. There's a lot that goes into that. So, anyway, uh, these are the settings I sort of dialed in for my voice here. So let's listen to that. But first, let's listen to the raw raw audio again. So I remember we were talking about or you guys mentioned binaural a couple times, and, and uh, there's also this uh, ambio thing, A-M-B-E-O, which I think, is it from Sennheiser? I don't know if they developed it or, yeah, okay. And it's where there's like a, a mic, it's like four micro. So even toward the end over here, you see, you see how I start to get really loud, right? And that's that was really loud. So let me turn on the max volume and let's listen to that section again. And what you're going to hear is that the loud parts aren't 
so loud, and then these lower parts are almost the same as all the other parts. It's really nice. Okay. So I remember we were talking about, or you guys mentioned binaural a couple times, and, and uh, there's also this uh, ambio. So you see right there, when I was mumbling, it was really nice and loud. You could hear it. And and again, in the plugin, just check out the amounts that it's, like you could see on the high level, you'll see the, the amount of gain reduction. There'll be a little red bar here coming down and you could see how much gain reduction is happening on the the high and uh, the high level and then on the lower level you you'll see from this yellow bar how much it's adding when i when i start to speak softly so so i'll play the whole thing with the max volume in right now okay so i remember we were talking about or you guys mentioned binaural a couple times and and uh there's also this uh ambio thing a m b e o which i think is it from Sennheiser? I don't know if they developed it or... Yeah? Okay. And it's where there's like a, a mic... It's like four microphones on a little ball. Okay, so that part at the end when I got really loud, you could hear the compressor pushing it down. This is really nice. This is... Honestly, as far as dynamics go, loudness and, and softness, this is one of the best plugins for podcasters because it's kind of easy to dial in and it really does it really does a good job. So that's max volume from Waves. I think they I think it's like $29 and again, I'm not telling you to buy it or anything. I don't make any money from this. Although I am an affiliate with Waves, but I never use the affiliate link cuz I always forget. Um but anyway, it's a really cool plugin and I will also link in the show notes there's a a video that Waves made. It's on YouTube. And, and the, so the people from Waves, you can see the videos from March 17th, 2014. Uh, so this is, this is an older plugin, but for podcast production, it, it's, it's, definitely, uh, it's definitely a goodie. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that little quick overview of Max Volume. And uh, that's it for now. I'll see you in the next video. And of course, if you want to know anything more about Podcast Engineering School, go to the website, podcastengineeringschool.com. Okay, we'll see you.